Yo, yo. What's going on, guys? Coming back at you with a little Ghost Recon gameplay. Of course, you know what this is. Ghost Recon Wildlands Iron Man Challenge. I'm your host, G Money Mozart, going through this game with no deaths, no mini map, no markers on extreme difficulty. So, uh, yeah, we left off last time right around here, and uh, we're picking it up. We're going to enter this Unidad base and um, take care of some business. Sniper up in the tower. Okay, this is the Unidad firebase. We're looking for the captain who's in contact with Yuri and Polito. We need the target alive. Roger that. Ua. Say the word. Creep up on this guy, take him out. We got a grunt all by it. Nice. There, in front of the bunker. Causing mass casualties, mass chaos. You know, just ghost stuff. on the Unidad captain. What we got? Why the hell is this? How's it going, fuckstick? Pentejos. You are dead. Hold up. Roger that. <laughs> Mierda. You may as well kill me now. I'm not talking, carajo. Well, that's your choice. But with a pair of sick fucks like Yuri and Polito, one day that might be you hanging from their ceiling. You can't trust them. It would be a relief if I took them out of your life. Look, I'm not a snitch, but let's just say, yeah, they freak me out. The thing is, they're not even in Itaqua. So call them back to Itaqua. Tell them you've got a package ready. Uh. Oye, Polito. I got a lamb ready for delivery. Un borrego. Let's get back on mission. I got ahead of myself. I shouldn't have released the hostages. I should have got in and out, and not, and then I should have released them while I was leaving, and then they, that would have caused chaos, you know, while I was on my way out. So this was dumb. It's just kind of a mess things up for me. There's a weapons case over here. Awesome. I can put this to use.
you know, the good part about that was that it did clear the entire area. So, got, got some free roam in here. That's it, we're clear. Rebels held it down. Good job. Yo, I got a weapons case here. I've been wanting one of these. So, tag everything, grab everything. We'll bring uh, the chopper back so I can get uh, my points for that and my resources. And um, yeah, we'll just keep it moving. Running through Taco nice and smooth. On me. No issues so far. You know, pretty easy, but it's to be expected in this land. So what we'll do, we'll bring this chopper back, we'll uh, hop in another chopper, we'll go take care of a uh, mortar mission. So we can drop bombs from the skies on our enemies. It's always good, you know, you want to have your, uh, your rebel support while doing this, because they're going to play a big factor in you getting through this game unscathed, unscarred. Swiping a helicopter to bring a day into focus. Pakatari's. Now that a couple are heading back to Itakwa, all we need to do is find out exactly where the hell they're gonna be. We need to head standing down. We're good to go. A lot of the mortar missions, the ones where you have to protect the, the broadcasts. The way I like to do it is I like to be in the chopper because it allows you to just use your guys and you know you can move around if need be. If worst comes to worst, you fly away, you do it another time. But being on the ground, 
sometimes there are problems, especially the way this game is programmed. Guys pop up out of nowhere. You think you have a sector cleared, and all of a sudden there's a guy there. So for these missions, I prefer uh, Dig in. The cartel's choppers. gonna hit this place hard once that transmission starts. All right. Uh, I'm gonna open up my mines, place some mines. So the guys that roll up in cars. If I could place them in good spots, they get blown up, boom, take out a whole car of guys. It'd be a lot easier that way. So, a few mines here and there, hop in the chopper, and uh, yeah. Placing a mine for our Sicario friends. I call the rebels for a diversion. Let me place a mine. Place mines now. Watch, watch a car drive into it and blow themselves up. That's why, I, you know, I shoot the passenger car so they cause a little traffic. Got on Yuri and Polito. Nothing yet, Amigo. Those two, they cover their tracks well. But my people are working on it. We will know something soon. In the meantime, my revolutionary brothers in Itaqua stand ready to help if you need them. Just call, and they will come. I'll keep that in mind. So now we have diversion open, mortars are open. Someone who can give you information on Yuri and Polito. I'm listening. One of my lieutenants managed to escape from them. He fled to a village called Kulta. Rather than give my man up to the cartel, the villagers hid him. Goddamn bravery right there. In response, Santa Blanca raised every home and executed all the villagers. Fuck. My lieutenant is still being kept alive. Probably so he can be killed in an even more painful way. Understood. We're heading to Kulta now. Eyes on two Unidad soldiers. Deploying drone. When you come to this area, guys, you always want to watch this back channel, because sometimes if you come up from the top, guys will sneak up from the path, uh, come around you. You won't even realize they're patrolling this area. 
and uh, yeah, you, so you just want to watch out for that. You don't want to take out this whole unit dead base Roger and then realize you missed someone. Spotted when we get into position. Guns. Copy that. Target Moving. number five. Sniper. Copy. Top of the tower. Target marked. I wonder if they'll ever make a game where the suppressor sound is real. Roger, let me get in position. Probably not. This is so embedded in, in our brains. Moving to a better position. Target acquired. Got the target. Lost visual on the target. Stealth. Target marked. I need a better position. Let me get into position. See if I've I can control. enable this. Copy. Target Got marked. Out of one shot. Let me get a good sight line. Roger that. Target marked. I don't have a shot to play. Standing by. Open fire. Wish there were better animations for that. Oh good, all clear. Walk up to him and like slit his throat or something. Real crazy. Resources, get the talent point, area is clear. We can uh, come on up here, pick up a chopper, and up, up, see what I mean, guys? I don't even know where that guy came from. Unless I missed him, he just popped up. But that's what I'm talking about. You have to all watch good, that. All clear. Because if you run out, you're not paying attention, you know, he'll pop you real quick. You'll, you'll die. Alright guys, so uh, reaching about 20 minutes for this video, I'm gonna, um, I'll end it here, and, uh, yeah, we'll pick up in, uh, in the next video. I will, uh, see you guys later.